There aren't a lot of pre-workouts out there that are designed for that cross-functional athlete. So when you begin training, you need energy, and that's why we've included caffeine and hydras. In phase two, your body is demanding ATP. So we've included creatine HCL, and once you're moving, we want to keep it that way. So we've added Fitnox to improve performance. We're really dedicated to providing pre-workout options for everyone, for every goal. Frank Seppi from Muscle and Fitness. Muscle and Fitness Hurts answering your DM questions. And obviously DM us, uh, we'll get to your question. So today's question is, fall's coming up. Spent the summer, barbecues, parties on the boat, and now you're a little bit out of shape and you want to get in shape for fall. So what are a couple of things that people should do to kind of get themselves back in, you know, motion and, and training and nutrition and everything else? So the first thing that comes to my mind when you mention this is the weather's going to get a little cooler. Mm -hmm. And as you know, we love outdoor cardio. And now it's not going to be so hot, so humid. You could put on a light jacket. I would say get outdoors more. Just start walking. Get mm -hmm. in your steps. Um, do some hikes. You know, get some Absolutely. really great um, be in nature, cardiovascular um, exercise. I think that would be a really great way to keep, for people to kickstart their progress going into the fall. I think people, there's a misconception. People think, well, I have to go back to the gym. You don't have to go back to the gym. Yeah. I mean, like you said, my favorite cardio is outdoor cardio. You know, walking and stuff. Time goes by so fast. You don't want to spend all the time in the gym. Yeah. So yeah, so it's really good. Get your steps in. Get a step counter. They have free. You get a free step counter on, on your phone, yeah. which is good. You know. But it's like, don't be so narrow-minded. No. Don't think just because you're not on the stairmaster, you're not no. doing cardio. Like some people think like that, and you're just limiting yourself. True, and I've got much better cardio workouts and results from doing outdoor cardio. Sometimes I look down and realize I did six miles instead of five or whatever because I'm just into it. You listen to your music, and it's just you got a lot of things going on too to like you know for your well being. Well -being. <laughs> but yeah, I think that's a good start, and also too nutrition, right? Ease yourself back. You can't go from eating seven cheeseburgers and hot dogs and potato chips and and nine margaritas to cold turkey, so ease your way, right? Absolutely, I always tell people, don't go from zero to 100, you're never mm -hmm. gonna succeed, you're setting yourself up for failure, just really take your goals and your um, plan incrementally. Absolutely, and when it comes to weight training, you don't have to follow a championship bodybuilder workout or female, male, whatever it is. Three days a week is plenty to start with, you know, train your entire body, you wanna look good from every angle, obviously. But yeah, three days a week is a good barometer to start with Monday, Wednesday, Friday, or if you're someone who has a weekend off, you can do something on the weekend. But try to get in multiple exercises, different, you know, and there's certain exercises you hate to do, do something different. Yeah. The more you love to train, the more you'll do it. Exactly. Right? It should be enjoyable. Yes, and if you need a trainer, where are you at? <laughs> and if you need a program, sleeveless. I love the sleeveless program. Sleeveless I've program. Been almost a year now. Yeah. Almost. It's crazy. We love it. And watch us Tuesdays, 10 o'clock. We might have other times we train during the week as well, but myself, Don Salvino, Maria Motor. Check us on Muscle and Fitness Instagram for the Sleepless Workout Program. Thank you, Maria. Appreciate it. I love it. Frank Seppi from Muscle and Fitness. Muscle and Fitness Hurts. There aren't a lot of pre-workouts out there that are designed for that cross-functional athlete. So when you begin training, you need energy. And that's why we've included caffeine and hydras. In phase two, your body is demanding ATP. So we've included creatine HCL. And once you're moving, we want to keep it that way. So we've added Fitnox to improve performance. We're really dedicated to providing pre-workout options for everyone, for every goal.